Good morning. You can't simply walk through the doors of the Jacksonville Humane Society right now, but you can join this Facebook group and check up and see how all the animals are doing. It's like online dating for a pet. The JHS Virtual Foster Meetup Group has about 1,700 members. People post every day saying how their foster pet is doing, and they update the group with success stories. It's a way the public can get to know the pet virtually during the coronavirus pandemic, and it also allows them to reach a larger audience. So I just want to give them like a warm, like cozy place to stay and so they could find their permanent home. <laughs> That's why Casey Roy and Liz Kofsky took home two cats to foster, but they fell in love and adopted. Bye. Assistant Development Director Lindsay Landecker even brought one home herself. Um, I fostered up a cat at the start of the epidemic, and I found her adopter in the virtual foster pet meetup group, and we did you know, a socially distanced safe drop off, and now she's in a loving home. Fostering socializes the animals and prepares them for their permanent home. Yeah, we've had a lot of time to bond with them and hang out. Lane Decker tells me there has been an influx of people wanting to help and there are still ways you can help. You can join the Facebook group I told you about and learn about these animals or go to their website and learn how to foster or adopt an animal yourself. In Jacksonville, Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.